Hola roadies, welcome to the road trip. Roadies, I'm coming to you today to tell you an awesome deal. Because if I have an awesome deal, I think I'm going to share it with the roadies because maybe it can help them out too. As you guys know, we guys we are in school, right? And if you've ever been to college, you know, textbooks for college are like ridiculous. I mean, with a capital R, ridiculous, right? And who has time to go on all the different websites for textbooks online to see if you can find them cheaper. Well, I found two websites that you can type in the ISBN codes to them and it will go and it will look through all the websites for you and give you the best deals. For example, last night I was helping uh, Val because Val was ta is taking classes next semester which starts the first week of January. Her books were um, $368. Well, I had one of the books, so she don't need that one, but the other ones were a total of like 268 bucks. $268 for two books. I went on these websites. I found each book on sale on Amazon used for under $10. I got both books for 20 bucks with no shipping because I'm a part of uh, Amazon Prime, which if you're a student, and as long as you give them your um, your student name or your student email address, you get six months free Amazon Prime, just so you know. That's awesome. And if you don't know what Amazon Prime is, you are you have access to like different TV shows and movies and stuff. But it's also cool for shipping because you get second day shipping for free. And it's like a discount rate for one day shipping. But second day shipping for free. I'm all, look, I'm all about a good deal. And if I can share it with you guys, I try to. So six months free Amazon Prime just because you're a student. Now, the two websites that um, I'll leave them down below. I know one of them is directtextbooks.com, and I want to say the other one's called Book Scouter, but I'll I'll leave both down there so you can check it out. Because listen, textbooks and co for college are crazy expensive, and if you can save any kind of money just by going to a few websites and buying them and not using your financial aid or what however you pay for your school books, you know. Um, why not, right? I mean, I saved Val today over $250 just by going online and doing a little research. So listen, I know who wants to talk about school, but it's a good deal. And especially if you go to Amazon Prime and if you're a student, especially right now with the holidays, to go on Amazon and be able to get Amazon Prime, and get free shipping for some stuff, that'd be awesome, right? I'm all about a good deal. Um, speaking of Amazon... I'm a little addicted to going on Amazon. I search for stuff like all, like yesterday I was searching for stuff just because I get the free shipping, you know, and I was like, hmm, maybe I could use a new phone case. Hmm, maybe I could buy a new t-shirt. <sighs> Amazon has everything. I just love Amazon. And this is not even sponsored by Amazon, but if Amazon wanted to give us a sponsorship, hey, I'm all about that life. And I'm all about that base. Side note, um, so... That is what I want to talk to you about today, really. That's about it. Lisa didn't get out of bed today until 2 p.m. And then she watched a little bit of the Tiger... Or no, the Tigers game. The Lions game. And now she's back upstairs in bed. She woke up not feeling too swift. And now she's back upstairs. And it's 7.30. So, um... She... I think she has, like, a sinus infection. I think that's what it is. But if you could just send out some positive vibes... That'll be great. I would truly appreciate it. What is up with this hair? Jeez Louise. I really... One day, I'm going to come on here and you're going to be so shocked at my hairdo. You're going to be like, oh my goodness, she finally cut her hair. One day. I'm not even going to tell you. It's going to... Randomly, it's going to be a surprise. I don't know when. By the way, I can't believe Christmas is only a few weeks away. So, you know we put our tree up last night. I got to tell you, I just love looking at the lights. I'm like a kid at heart. I swear to you, I am because I just love looking at the lights. I sit in the front room just smiling just because the Christmas tree there. Do you guys have that? Do you guys just feel like in a better mood with the Christmas tree up? I think we should keep the tree up all year. Thoughts and opinions? Comment section below. Christmas tree up all year. I vote yes. What do you think? No? Maybe? Tell me in the comment section. Also, do you have any like... What's the right word to use? Maybe unique, any unique um, Christmas traditions you or your family do? Tell them in the comment section below. We really don't do much. We go, I usually go to my grandmother's on Christmas Eve. We used to open presents, <laughs> well, let's be honest, as kids. Um, oh, 
I have a unique, a unique tradition I can share with you guys. So when we were kids, we would always go to the packages and shake them, right? Who didn't do that? Right? I still try to do it when I'm an adult. Um, and my mom and dad got so irritated at us going to the packages and shaking them that they stopped putting our names on the packages. And then for years, we would just be like different things. Like we were, you know, fruits. So on the packages, it would just say, you know, two apple, two orange, two pear, two pineapple, whatever, you know. And then we were Disney princesses. We've been tools. We've been um, colors. We've been like all sorts of things over the years. And for years, this is how we did it. I mean, now that we're grown, it's like... Well, I still shake on, I'm not going to lie. But you know what I mean. Um, we really don't do it too often now. But that was something cool growing up. And I, every time I would tell my friends, they were like, why did your parents do that? It's like, because we shake the pro the, the packages and trying to figure out what it is. So if you don't know what... Who, what no, um, and usually we find out what name we are in our stockings Christmas morning. So that was always cool growing up. I, I used to love that. That was that was that was definitely cool. Tell me comment section below any Christmas traditions you and your family do that are kind of unique or awesome. Okay? Brody's gonna be up for the day. I'm thinking I'm gonna go watch a Hallmark movie. I have to go get Val from work. She gets off in twenty minutes. I'm gonna watch a Hallmark movie when I get back, upload this video and call it a DAY. So say it with me. Today I can do anything. Say it, believe it, achieve it, Brody's. And go check out the websites down below. And if you're a student, go check out Amazon Prime. I'm telling you, it's so worth it for six months. And it's free. And then you can cancel it within the first six months. And then, or, you know, right before the six months ends, before it charges you. And then, um, so it's a bit free. It's all, I'm all about that life. Okay. Everybody's have a wonderful day. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.